she's a cool kid. She's a cool kid. And she's a rock star. Also, at Hughes Girls. That's on Facebook and Twitter. And I said, my rockers don't do And he has a Facebook account. So, actually, most rockers do Facebook. Most of them, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's say all rockers don't do Facebook. Not all rockers do Facebook. Exactly. But <laughs> some of them do Facebook. Yep. Right. But we need Facebook. We have people who still don't know how Twitter works. So, oh, really? yeah. Oh, yeah. So. Yes. Okay. Twitter. And uh, there's a friend of mine <laughs> who's on Twitter, and he was telling me, like, um, he just joined Twitter recently. Mm -hmm. So he's used to Facebook posting a photo and getting, like, yeah. uh, 500, 700 likes. Uh -huh. He goes on Twitter, gets one like. <laughs> he's like, what is da, going da, da. <laughs> It's like, I don't like Twitter. It's Kulina giving me a low self-esteem. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> it's giving me a low self-esteem. I don't like it. Like, Twitter is not cool. Facebook is cool. So I'll stick with Facebook. <laughs> Right, and we have so much love, like so many people are on the TL, I don't even uh, yeah. know, okay. but mm -hmm. I think we should, uh, first of all, we should introduce our topic of the day first, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then mm -hmm. we'll, uh, we'll be back to read the Pick comments. Mm -hmm. So today we're talking about, um, right, just getting over the loss of a loved one, just because uh, yeah, okay. we're still paying homage yeah, to the, the yeah, guys uh, that lost their lives at this 52, yeah. which yeah. was very unfortunate. Mm -hmm. I know guys are trying to move on, so we just want to help, like... Um, you want different ideas from the guys at home and from you guys, uh -huh. like on how people move on after losing someone you're very close to, uh -huh. a family member, a friend, or a friend of a, a friend, could be a celeb you like so much, Bana. like just anyone. Like uh, dealing with a loss is very yeah, hard. Like uh, I understand, uh, yeah. Oliver Mtukuzi. Yes, yeah. he's like uh, one of those legends. He's an yeah, icon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Even uh, as a guy, Tambua as in uh, I liked his music, his guitar right. playing. Yeah, I've learned a lot from him. So so, yeah. You know Olivam Tukuzi? Definitely. <laughs> so the <laughs> thing I, I asked, because we were here for in e on Thursday, and guys were like, oh, we know Tori. People yeah, don't even Tori. know he had a song with uh, Eric Wainaina. They're shall like, wait. yeah, by the way. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> true that, like true that. They, they didn't know that even lady jd they had a song with her mm -hmm. people don't know that so oh, i feel okay. like uh, yeah it's cool like we're playing kenya music now yeah. but we've been, we've always done that but yeah. it's I, I feel like it's a good thing right yeah, yeah yeah okay so let's talk about um getting over a loved one so um at some point in life everyone loses someone they love they love like uh, it's uh it's just a way of nature it's a way of life like it happens so they like it or not like at some point it has to happen right yeah, yeah. So, um, being one of the most difficult life events imaginable, like you need to cope in a way that's healthy, even if it's painful, you need a healthy way of mourning. You know, some people like um, know that, okay, no one can ever tell you how to like uh, mourn or deal with uh, losing a loved one. You do it your own way. But there are some, some people, they go into depression yeah. and it, they get affected mentally and they never get over it. So, there are some ways you can actually... Um, there's some things you can consider to be able to get over yeah, a yeah, loved yeah. one. Mm -hmm. So maybe Yvonne can tell us one. <laughs> tell us one. And here's uh, your next. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> one way is um, find someone you can talk to. Because if you, you're just there mm -hmm. mourning on your own, mm -hmm. trust me, yeah. you'll fall into depression. True. So get that one person, if those two people that you can mm -hmm. talk to. Mm -hmm. Talking helps. Right. Mm -hmm. Skills. Me, okay, for me what works is find a way of closure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just find a way you can engage closure. Yeah. And punga that vibe. And also the thing is also sometimes it depends on how you guys related. So I can't be on point on it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Right. So yeah. we have a few ways that we thought like uh you people can actually use mm -hmm. to get over De like to deal with the emotions, right? Yeah. Well, the first one is allow yourself to experience your feelings. You know, yeah, some people will yeah, not yeah. let that happen. Don't shut it out. Yeah, yeah, you yeah shut just it embrace out. it. Yeah, true. You turn to alcohol mm. or maybe just something that will make mm. you not feel anything. Yeah. Well, that's unhealthy. Numb yourself. Yeah, so make sure you experience it. Like, it's very important that you allow yourself to feel what you're feeling, even mm. if it's bad. Like, mm. suppressing your feelings is I not a good idea. Helps, yeah. and it's the aftermath yeah, like yeah, yeah, it's yeah. just crazy mm -hmm. so supp suppressing grief can lead to anger anxiety and mm -hmm. substance abuse if yeah you know do some mountain about. climbing and yeah. stuff you know yeah definitely so um yeah. like Yvonne said express your feelings to others definitely mm -hmm. if you're going through something cool, you yeah, have to let true. your friends the people you trust people around you Right, yeah, yeah they yeah. have to know what you're going through. Just tell them how you're feeling. But we want to involve you, the guys. That we want you, 
guys at home yeah. to be part of the discussion. So Tell talk us. to us. We mm. have more. Ambias. We have more of this. Mm. We'll be mm. telling you as we go. But yeah. we want to hear from you as well. That is our yeah. 254 channel. Their hashtag is hashtag rock tour 254 at Philian Jun mm. at Wine Dubi at Heavy and the Beast mm. at Hugh, Hugh Skills. Skills. Yeah, talk to us. Talk mm. to us. We want to hear from you. But right before we go, we have plate or trash it oh ready. yay yes that is my favorite part of the show because <laughs> <laughs> i always get to ask this now Yvonne doesn't like it at all <laughs> yeah because you choose very interesting ones as guys are just turn in between every other time you're like <laughs> so, so yeah, Yvonne doesn't like it yeah. but today I today is her. not hard today uh. is actually very reasonable oh, oh, new music uh, very oh, new oh, like okay. um, the oldest song here is actually one but week. the bands the bands yeah, are the, they new like, uh, Though this one is <laughs> one week. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's right, easy. so today we have uh, the first one is Bring Me the Horizon. Wow, wow. Yes, wow, and that wow, one, wow, I know wow, wow, the discussion wow, wow, online, wow. I cannot even. <laughs> I, I can't. Like, um, so you all know about the album. Really? They just launched an yeah. album. I don't want to talk about, about it. That, we will have in, to. That's it, why I like it's it. It's on another level. <laughs> I will That's tell you. Like it's it. a long, I will tell you. Why. Right, right. So we have Bring Me the Horizon. They have a new album out. It's called Amo, by the way. If you haven't checked it out, we we have um we have just one song from the album we'll be playing it so it's called nihilist blues mm -hmm. but they have so much more so you can check it on youtube and then number two we have wiza with no scrubs and believe me you uh, know okay, these no scrubs. scrubs yes no scrubs Ile Moja. yes they've done a cover for it Wiza is it tlc or something yes tlc <laughs> 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 so they sampled that song. I remember awesome. the first one they did was the Africa. You remember? Uh -huh. the total Africa. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, they yeah. did Africa. Mm -hmm. And now they've done North Crabs. Yeah. And then the last one you have Brutas with Wolf. So that's okay. for Plate or Trashy. We have uh, Bring Bring Me the Horizon, uh -huh. Nice Blues. And then we have uh, Wiza. Uh -huh. <laughs> Right, so we have Bring Me the Horizon, Nice Blues, we have Weezer with No Scrubs, and then we have Brutas with War. But first things first, we're not skipping this one. I know Yvonne doesn't like it, but we have to talk about it. Bring Me the Horizon. I've seen so many interesting comments. People are throwing shit at them, mm -hmm. like everywhere. Just rockers are really upset. Yvonne, tell us why. I am why upset. Are you upset? I am so upset. <laughs> <laughs> Like, Bring Me How the Horizon How has been one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. Yes. And I've, I like them from their death code days, metalcore, but Wanna. I'm now. confused. I don't know how like to how feel. Like, how now? I don't know what how to now? feel. Which now? Who because now? when they released their previous album, yeah. The Spirit, it took me two months to listen to that album. Yeah. Because I was again like, and again what is still. this? What is this? <laughs> but I got used to it. But now this album... Trust I me, cannot. I've only listened to one song, and, you're like, and I was disappointed. So, what like, did you Aish. listen to? What I did? listened to that mm. song featuring Danny Field because I thought those are two two of my favorite vocalists mm -hmm. in one song. But right. mm. nah, it like, was a disappointment. I think I liked Mother Tank. Mm. <laughs> Maybe okay, not liked liked, mm. but like uh, I was like, uh, well, all right, she's, not so bad. No, she has that kapat and that kapop thing uh, in her heart. There's Mother Tank, and then there's this one we are playing. Well, now it's blue. Yeah. Yeah. So. Actually, I'm gonna hear it for the first time here. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, uh... oh, rockers are like, yo, no way, they've gone pop, they've betrayed us. Okay, so Hugh Skills, which mm. one? Huh? Which one is your fave from their album? TLC thing. I, I, oh, I, I didn't listen to that album. I didn't listen to the first. I was like, eh. okay, sour. Asante sana, asante sana. <laughs> Right, so Wiza. I'll stick to albums. This so Wiza is your favorite. Yeah. Now I'll go with the third one, uh, Brutus Wall. I feel like it's my favorite, my personal favorite, just because the way it starts. So it's so the vocals are just out of the place, and then it gets like uh, now the guitar and everything just comes in and becomes mayhem. Yeah, that's I thing, like yeah. that. Yeah. So have, let's go ahead and just listen to the songs. You yep. guys can be the judge and head over to Twitter at Twitch Perfect Channel. We'll be putting a post up so that you get to vote for your favorite. Yep. So first, let's listen, right? Yeah. 